Harness fans are pondering if she's the greatest NZ made pacing filly ever. Adore me and Mark Purden, this very special filly. Adore me streaking away with the Oaks. We're past adoration. It's got to be love. And Adore me won the Oaks easily and beat Saavedra in splendour. Helena Jet fourth, then Cabet. She can handle anything now. She's just unbeatable. Mark, is there anything these days that surprises you about her? Because uh, she appears to be as good as we've seen, certainly in the last couple of decades. Yeah, she is. Greg, as you said, we're running out of superlatives, so bad as she's, she does the talking here. Here's another win for this champion filly. It's now nine from ten, and the Neverly Art filly series is all adore me's, and she won it and has beaten Whisper Jet, and third will be a dead heat between Rozelski and Delightful Christian. We had a nice spot early on, and uh, when they weren't going much, I thought it was a good time to get around them. You know, she was just clearly the best horse in it. Adore me with 100 metres to go. He turned the stick, Mark Purden, but she responded. Nukamai, splendour, delightful Christian for miners. At three, she's a princess, but this girl is already a harness racing queen. And Adore me won it. Well, she looks something special, but it'll be for the public to make up their minds how they see her in history. Luck at the present time is standing by my side but he may turn around and go the other way. I know racing. There isn't a filly around that can beat her. And I think she may do the same to them in Australia.